friends are cool. We vlog at the pool. And we vlog at your school. We vlog as a family. We vlog every day. And now that was the bottom. All right, well, kind of a stressful day this morning. Uh, the girls were just running in reverse. I got them up at 7.30, and by 8.33, we were out of the house, over an hour. Then Emily forgot a recorder, and uh, Mommy reminded her last night about it, and somehow she still forgot it. So she wants me to go home and grab it for her, but I've done that so many times before, I need her to learn that if you forget your stuff, it comes back on you. So today I'm not going back to get it. Plus I'm already late for work, so I don't want to get fired. Um, so I got to get to work. You know, there's stuff I need to do. And uh, I'm sorry, Emily. So it's, it's a life lesson you need to learn. All right, so this morning when I was dropping the girls off, uh, the Ellingtons were in front of us and uh, Abigail and Emily got out of the car. And as soon as the little boy from the Ellington, the triplets saw Abigail, his face lit up it was really cute to see that uh happen so uh it's good to see abigail brighten some people's lives All right, here comes a train, it's out of service. I guess it's heading back. And here we are at the construction site. You got a dump truck just about to pull in here. I don't know if there's enough room or not, but uh, here's your daily update of the construction site. Obviously I'm uptown heading to work. Cranes in action and movement right now. I guess they're going to be putting those steel things in soon. They've been building those the past couple days. Good to see the guys back to work. You got the food truck here. Busy morning. Everybody's trying to catch up from uh, taking yesterday off because of the rain. Maybe they're trying to beat the rain today. I'm not sure what the weather's supposed to look like. headed back over to the radio studio. I have to interview a guy from Belgium. His name is Steens Longin. He is four for four in the NASCAR Euro Series this year. Race wins, undefeated. Hallway, corridor, underground, stairway. All right, so that interview went well. Um, Couple, couple technical things. He wanted to uh, load Skype onto his computer, so I was waiting for him to do that. But then once we got hooked up with uh, Skype on the computer, everything went great. Um, it was an interview from Belgium, which is which is crazy to think. You know, I'm just talking to a dude from Belgium, and uh, it was free. Skype is free, which is awesome. So cool. Um, now I get to go up and uh, edit, finish the uh, motorcycle interview I did yesterday, and then. Uh, after that, probably just heading home, um, picking the girls up off the bus today, so. Some days there's just not enough time in the day. I miss the train. The girls will be home alone. I think they'll be okay. Just running behind anyway. Here's the construction site update for today. Uh, looks no different, I guess, than this morning. The steel things got moved. Guys, uh, something big in that hole. We're doing more uh, support pilings down this way. And uh, crane's still working. More dump trucks coming in. More concrete being laid down over there. Just progress, man. Progress. Looking good. Looking good.
All right, so I've been freaking out that I'm late, I'm late. I've been texting Emily, it's 4.11. Oh man, guess what? The girls have danced today. Mom picked them up from school. So I'm not late. <laughs> Thank goodness. I was just like, oh my goodness, I'm so late. They're gonna be mad at me, I'm in trouble. Whew. Mom's got them. Phew. Oh, what a relief. I hate being late to pick that mom, I hate it. All right, well, I'm on my way home. To do what? I don't know. I know what, the garage. I need to clean more of the garage. I haven't done that in days. And mommy came home and now she's leaving to go to group. Okay. And so did the girls came home from dance. Okay. And I have been working on the garage. Just a tiny bit girl. though, un poco. Mama looks good. You have an hour? That's right, 8.30 in bed, girls. And no cannoli for you. All right, All right have fun. See you later. Bye-bye, wife. All right, so I wonder what the girls and I will kind of, what kind of trouble will we get into tonight? Hmm, wonder, wonder. What can we do? Tonight. All right. Well, we met some new neighbors tonight, and we saw Michael, and Paul was out, and Joy, and the girls were riding their bicycles. <laughs> How you doing with those training wheels, Abby? Good. Having fun on them? Mm -hmm. Are you touching them? Mm, not much. Yes, yes. Good. All right. Well, waiting for mommy to come home. Look at the beautiful moon up over the house. Look at that. Beautiful night here in Charlotte, North Carolina. It was supposed to rain tonight, but it is. See? it's not. Look See, at this. Look at, the ground. look at the pretty clouds in the yeah, sky. Look at the ground. It's raining. Pretty yeah. clouds in the pretty sky yeah. in Charlotte, North Carolina. And it's still cool out, which is See, nice. It's raining. Girls, don't waste your stuff, your juice. I don't like my juice. I don't like the pops. You really don't have any juice in these things. Popsicles for dessert tonight. Where's the um, scissors? I'll get them for you. All right, everybody. It's a bedtime. It's bedtime at the Rye Breads. So I'll uh, be the best human being you can be. And we'll see you on Thursday. Thursday, Thursday. And uh, have a good night, everyone. Abigail, you going to say good night? That's not saying good night. Yeah. Bye, Dad. You're the best human being you can be. Good night. For some more rye breads? Yeah, me too. Just click over here to check out our family's journey. We're a family of four here in Charlotte, North Carolina. Just uh, providing some daily entertainment on YouTube. Hope you enjoy it. Thanks for watching.